Hi everyone, welcome to another day in the life of Miara Salgudo. The word of the day is ownership. Is Ownership is, we all like to pretend that we're perfect and then we do a great job every time, but we don't. And sometimes things go unseen and sometimes it's not even our fault. Sometimes it's just part of what we do. And I think one of the most valuable things in a person is ownership of your actions. When you're taking ownership for somebody's actions that is under you. So that's the word of the day. We are finishing up a house, a beautiful house he's uh, doing in uh, our favorite subdivision, Church of Oaks. And we were just going over light heights and um, just changing a few little things, like just the final touches, like tweaking uh, uh, a rock wall that it was done inside of the house. That is actually the funnest stuff because it's fun. Because we're just like, it's very, it's the final stretch and everybody's excited. The homeowner is excited. I just love it. I actually love construction as much as I sometimes hate it and I hate how confrontational it is. And, and I find it super difficult that I, sometimes feel like I am in between a hard place in a rock, literally, but trying to walk the line, not upsetting the contractor that is doing the job and trying to service the homeowner. But I mean, we walk the line, that's what we, did. we do. And I think this needs to be loose too. I mean, I think if he was well, that, four inches back, back he's right there. Yeah, I think he needs to go a little bit back, Richard, because I think he would show more. He has to go back. That's without a doubt. That's, I think, the only thing. So it's either go back to the right or no, just he's, go back. I think he just needs to go back. I think details are super important. I think. Sometimes builders don't see things the way designers do. I think an inch makes a big difference. The monkey-like pictures is protruding too much outside into the counter space and needs to be back out a little bit, but it's actually located in the perfect corner, uh, thinking of the way the monkey is facing. So it just needs to go a little back, like three inches to the back. When it came to the man cave, uh, the way the homeowner wants the TV mounted, I mean, he wanted mounted there for a reason. It's his special space, so we have to respect that. But he also have a beautiful piece that need to be mounted in the wall, and we cannot mount that in the same space as the, as the TV. So where would you put his TV? Well, I would put his TV there. Maybe he don't like that, but I, but now this is the hole is already not done. Yeah, you can have, we can't do that, guys. It's too late. It's too late. So you just said it. That room looked like it's other James Bond yeah. movie, right? I cannot wait to show it off to everyone. We are dealing. The apartment is almost done. It's beautiful, but we're dealing with these horrible leak that we cannot find and it's being like horrible but you have to also be there and take ownership and and be there for the you know for the things you don't want to be there for when it comes to the construction aspect we're done we're doing like aesthetics now except for the roof area that we're dealing with that leak. It's difficult because they come and go and we don't want to bother them, but I think we have mitigated that and we are to the finish line, except for that issue. No, this is already open. Right, right. Yeah, so yeah, down. you're here. Yeah. Go ahead. You can absolutely still come, come to here which is like 24, yep. So that's, 
this is the door is completely open here i i kind of feel like we can steal six inches this way all right let's see what it looks like yeah so that would put us at like 42. and you said you've done 36 right and oh yes yeah right? yeah is yeah. that yeah. still gonna no, I, I think like the door is going to be open. All right, time. it's not, and she wants to be able to open it and be here. Right. Yeah. Like that's the thing. But I mean, you still like forty six. I mean, if you back this up, six inches will be one, two, three, four, five, six. Like let's say sixty five. With a counter, it will be right there. So you still have forty six and a half, right? You still have all this space between the door fully open to where you and the counter. I think it's completely okay. fine. So that's a beautiful home, but it's a small home. So we were trying to mitigate, like, should we steal six inches from the island hallway or from the hallway to the house? Um, I know it sounds like something very small, but six inches are a lot. And I think we needed him the other side. I think she was a little bummed because she won that in her walkway in the kitchen, but I think she needed him the other side. See, I'm not always saying what the homeowner wanted here. I try to be objective to what I think works best for the home in the long run. It's not a huge home. It doesn't need to have a huge walk in the space between the island and the sink or the ovens, like three and a half feet will do it because we at least have to have the same in the, in the hallway. And like I said, the way the entrance is, you walk into the kitchen and then go. Um, so I was trying to fight to have three and a half feet in both. As you all know, I always have to go. I have something else to do. So I'll see you guys next week uh, from Montana this time. Bye.